and in a year's time, the mother of Jimmy Atkins has uh, passed away from I, I, what I consider to be a broken heart. Mm -hmm. And so, as an elected official, I'm standing with him today to let him know that we are listening. He's not in this battle by himself. You know, we often say black on black crime, but that's a misnomer because crime is relative to the community that it happens in. What we should make sure while we're supporting law enforcement, and I do support law enforcement, however, I ponder this question to you. How many individuals have died at the hands of law enforcement or have died in custody in law enforcement? Now, if you've got a number in your mind, I would ask you this. How many of them are people that are non-color? We have to ask ourselves these questions. We have to have these very uncomfortable conversations. We recently celebrated 911, and I spoke about the support that we have for law enforcement and what they need. Me speaking in support of law enforcement does not dictate that we should cover up or turn our hand away when one of them does something wrong. Mm -hmm. There has been an investigation. There has been a call for uh, consequences. And the consequences have not been served of a person who happened to be law enforcement but killed one of our members of the community. And so I'm here today to let uh, Mr. Uh, Jimmy Hill know that I support him because that could be my son, that could be your son, that could be my father, your father. We must hold everyone accountable because you wear a badge does not give you a license to take a life. You are held to a higher standard. And so we must come in the mindset if we're ever going to heal, and we're ever going to be that beloved community, those that serve the community must be brought forth for the actions that they have done in service to their community that is a disservice when they take a life. So I'm here supporting him and letting him know, I hear you, the struggle is still going on, but I'm a firm believer that Jimmy Atkinson will have justice for that.